I have a Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 3 here. I'm going to show you how to transfer your photos and videos directly from your phone to a Apple computer, MacBook, or iMac using the charging cable and without using iTunes, okay? Now, in my opinion, this is the easiest way to transfer um, files and videos from an Android phone to your MacBook, okay? So first thing you have to do is download this Android file transfer. It's a free download. Once you download it, then it's done. Once you download it and install it, it's going to be a little green Android guy down there. I'll put a link below in the description for this, okay? And once you do this, the transferring is super easy, okay? So after you download it, that Android file transfer, next thing is go ahead and uh, plug in your, your phone using the charging cable. Now take note, the thing is, with the Fold 3, your charging cable is a USB-C to USB-C. The thing is, on this MacBook, I don't have a USB-C or Thunderbolt 3 port. So my only option is I can use one of these cables I have laying around, a USB-A to a USB-C here, or another option is I can use this little tiny adapter I have. Okay, it's a, a USB to a USB-C. So I can use either of those. I'll put links below for the adapter and the cable too. But so from here, let me just go ahead and plug this into here. The other end I'm gonna plug into my MacBook here. And now let's go ahead and grab my Fold 3 here. Let's pop that in. Now let's go ahead and sign in. Don't worry about what's on the screen right there. Let's just go ahead and sign in here. All right, I'm going to sign in. Now you should get a message on your phone. It says, allow access to phone data. I'm going to tap on allow right there. Okay. And now, let me go ahead. And... Okay, so if that window disappears, just go back down here to the Android guy. And we're going to tap on that. And then here we are. Okay, so from here, these are all my folders I have on my Fold 3. Now you can see the DCIM folder, that's where all your photos and videos are that you take it on your phone. So let me double click on that, DCIM, and then we're gonna double click on camera. And now you can see I only have a few photos and videos. I have some uh, photos in here I know because it has a JPG, JPEG extension. I know that they're video files because the MP4 extension, okay? Anyway, from here, because we downloaded that Android file transfer, it's pretty much a Windows computer. Now what we can do is just drag and drop. We can drag and we can drop it right onto the desktop as if it's a Windows computer. If you didn't have the Android file transfer, if you try to move to the desktop, it's gonna it's gonna um, go right back down into into there. Okay. So what I typically do is I'll just make a new folder on the desktop and I'll call this one Fold Three. And then I can drag and drop whatever I want to that folder. Uh, I'll just do the whole shebang here. I'll highlight all of them. I'll drag and drop into that new folder I just called Fold 3. Let it go ahead and transfer. All right, and there we go. Now I can go ahead and disconnect my phone in that new folder that I just made, Fold 3. Double click on that, and voila, there's my photos and videos. And from here I can go ahead and uh, save these or edit these or whatnot. Pretty simple. Questions or issues, just comment below. All right, good luck, guys.